What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Salute the General, and I'm here to do the uh, Week 2 NFL picks. Uh, unfortunately, the homie Joe is out of town, so he uh, couldn't make the video, but I do have his picks. Um, first, I'll start with saying last week, um, I pretty much whooped his ass. <laughs> I ain't going to talk no shit because he ain't here to defend himself, but I went 11-4 and four last week. And um, homie Joe went seven and eight. So we're going to keep those records on the books. And uh, at the end of the season, whoever has the better record uh, wins. And the loser has to do some sort of a challenge or something. But we haven't figured out what it's going to be yet. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and start with my week two picks. And uh, I'll read you off his. I have his picks on written down. And um, we'll see what happens this week. So we start off with the uh, Houston Texans going against the Cincinnati Bengals at home. Uh, both day asses got their ass whooped last week, so should be pretty damn interesting if you ask me. Um, I'm going with the Bengals because they're at home and because they got shut out. And I'm thinking the uh, Texans are going to be playing with uh, – Deshaun Watson, the rookie quarterback. So I'm not going to go with the rookie on his first start. Um, yeah, I got the Bengals winning that one. And then we got the Bills going against the Panthers. Bills are some shit besides Shady. Uh, so I'm going with the Panthers. Home field advantage. Cam Newton, even though he looked rusty as hell last week. Um, after that, we got the Bears. Going into Tampa Bay. Tampa Bay fresh off the bye week. <laughs> I know they got to be pissed. I know I'd be mad if I got to play 16 games in a row. But um, I got Tampa Bay winning that. They're at home. Extra rest. They had longer to prepare for their opponent. So I think uh, Jameis going to go ahead and throw the ball all around the field. Hoping anyway because he's my damn fantasy quarterback. But that's beside the point. Um, then we got the Vikings going into Pittsburgh. I wasn't really sure how I was going to go on this game, but, uh, ended up going with Pittsburgh since they're at home. And, uh, I mean, I know Sam Bradford looked like a fucking monster on Monday night, but, uh, I don't know if that's going to keep up. I mean, I'm not a Sam Bradford hater like most Philly fans are, but, um, I just think. Pittsburgh got way too many weapons, and uh, like I said, they're at home. I tend to favor the home teams, um, which doesn't segue good into this one, the Cardinals against the Colts. Um, <laughs> I got to go with Arizona. The Colts didn't show me anything. They looked like the worst team in football last week. Um, not that Arizona was – you know, great, and they lost David Johnson, but I don't know. The Colts just look real bad, so <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and go with the uh, Cardinals in that one. Then we got the Patriots going into New Orleans. Patriots going to whoop that ass. They got embarrassed by the Chiefs on Thursday night. I'm pretty sure Bill Belichick chewed their ass out. Um, Yeah, so I see, the, I see the Patriots going in there and winning big. New Orleans defense still looks suspect, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, then I got Cleveland playing Baltimore. Baltimore all day. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's not much to discuss. That defense looked amazing against the Bengals, and I don't think Cleveland got better offensive weapons than uh, the Bengals did, so. Going with the Ravens. Probably win big again. Uh, then we got Philly going into Kansas City. I don't know about this game. Um, I went with the Eagles because I, one, I'm an Eagles fan. <laughs> Two, um, I don't know. Kansas City had a great game. And if I know anything about Andy Reid, he'll um, – build you up just to break you down. You know what I'm saying? So 
they probably come in there riding high, thinking it's going to be gravy. They're going to have a great season. And um, I think we're just going to go in there and fuck them up, hopefully. I, I wouldn't say fuck them up. But I think it'll be a close game. But I think we'll win 28-24. Um, then we got Tennessee going into Jacksonville. Um I'm going with the Jags. Uh, I like Marcus Mariota, but I've been saying for years the Jags are on the come. And I uh, think it's about their time. They 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 looked pretty good last week. Uh, granted, it's just week one. I just feel like if they can uh, avoid the turnovers, Blake Bortles don't be out there looking like a fucking bum. You know, the defense should be able to hold Marcus Mariota and them down. And, uh, Got the Jags winning at home. Then we got the Jets at Oakland. Like, I'm going to pick the Jets. Yeah, right. Oakland. Nothing else to say. Uh, Miami at the Chargers. Um, I'm going with the Chargers. For one, they're, you know, in L.A. And uh, haven't seen nothing from Miami yet. So I don't really know what they're going to be like with Jay Cutler. I mean, he looked decent in the couple preseason games he played, but, um, yeah, till I see, you know, what they were and what I'm going to go with the Chargers because the Chargers played a hell of a fourth quarter against Denver. Um, then we got Dallas, bum-ass Cowboys playing against the Broncos in Denver. And as much as I hate to say it, I'm going with the Cowboys. Um... I don't know. I kind of want to pick Denver. But. I don't know. I'm going to pick Dallas. Don't really have a reason. Uh, Then we got the 49ers. Going into Seattle. Another game of the week. (laughs) Got Seattle busting their ass. Uh, Then we got the Washington Redskins. Going against the Rams. Got the Rams winning that. Um, They looked pretty good last week. Um, Jared Goff looked like he's finally going ahead and uh, learning how to play NFL quarterback. Or it could just be that uh, whoever they was playing last week was just some shit. Oh, damn, they was playing the Colts. My bad. (laughs) My bad, homie Joe. Uh... (laughs) But, yeah, uh, Kirk Cousins, to me, looked suspect last week. I was at the game. Um, Yeah, I don't think the Redskins are built like that this year. Uh, Then I believe the Sunday night game is Green Bay going into Atlanta. It's a hell of a game right here. Um, Rematch of last year's NFC Championship game. Uh. We'll go ahead and go with the Falcons. Matt Ryan and uh, Julio Jones put up a little bit of money. Green Bay offense didn't look that good last week. I mean, they were playing the Seahawks, who have a hell of a defense, but I don't know. We, we, we'll figure out who's the real deal this week. Um, And then the Monday night game is uh, Detroit going against the Giants. Got the Giants winning that on a bounce back. Um, I think Detroit's a hell of a team also, but um, yeah. I definitely think Giants got that, especially if Odell Beckham comes back. If Odell Beckham isn't back, I don't know, because that offense looks terrible. Cause I don't think the Cowboys' defense is that damn good. Um, all right, now we're going to go ahead and read down uh, – Homie Joe's picks. He has the uh, the Texans beating the Bengals, the Panthers beating the Bills, the Bucks beating the Bears, the Vikings beating Pittsburgh. Of course, he went with the Colts over Arizona. Um, he has the Patriots beating New Orleans, Baltimore beating Cleveland, 
Philly beating Kansas City. Good look, homie Joe. Uh, he has Tennessee beating the Jags. Um, let's see, what's the next game? Oakland over the Jets. Chargers over Miami. Dallas over Denver. Seattle over the 49ers. The Rams over Washington. Green Bay over Atlanta. And Detroit beating the Giants. So, looks like we got a couple more discrepancies in our picks this week. So, that lead to either game, which I think is going to happen, or he'll close the gap a little bit. But, um, yeah, we're going to see how it goes. Uh, let us know in the comments section who you guys got winning this week. Um, and if you enjoyed the video, make sure you click that thumbs up and uh, share, subscribe. And uh, I'll catch y'all next week for uh, the reveal of the records and week three's picks. Uh, gonna go ahead and check on out. Salute the general. Gone. Go Birds.